Welcome, Knights and Witches, back to the show. We're going to the Serpent's Den. I wonder if there are snakes there. This video is short. I like that. There will be loading screens, though. I can feel her power. It grows thick. She is near. Apparently, Trudy is very thick. A hallway level. Marvelous. This thing is massive! Uh, this thing is basically a chain chomp. What's g Oh, Heinrich stripped. It did fuck all. I'm guessing we can rule out a hands-on approach. And here's a maracas guy to keep us company. Seriously, what do I do here? Gretchen, any thoughts? I keep forgetting the control scheme. I'll practice on this guy. Let's fuck up the snake. At no point will its health bar indicate we're making progress. Slithered off. The snake must be slithering back to wherever True Day is. Snake slithered, do you know that? It must have slithered here before. Right, we know the weakness. Let's break the bark and hit the core with all the magic. There's the core, glitching. No effect. I even used the hammer on the fucking core from above. What gives? I really should put more heavy attacks into my combos. I got through six God of War games and somehow earned a Platinum in Dante's Inferno. You'd think I would have learned something. Oh yeah, there are three logs in this level containing collectibles, and a ton of non-breakable ones. And so we both wait. If you have no idea where Gretchen is, neither do I. It's not like I need to protect her. Thanks for coming, mate. We could use some upbeat rhythm. I guess I'm hitting him? This is a waste of time. Let's follow it. What, not even a cutscene? Heinrich looks a bit injured. What 
were those two doing together in one hell portal? Hello, Gretchen? You again. This thing is really going out of its way. A freezing mechanic. Everybody loves that, right? I can't exactly go out there and hit it because going there is what triggers the attacks. going. No cutscene again, it just disappears. Commencing Operation Flyswatter. Technically, I suppose I could be killing them faster if I had splurged on the upgrades, but we'll save that joy for the darker times. Safe point. Right, we're entering the inevitable boss part of the level. I want to finish playing Deadly Creatures now for some reason. Damn! It's got us! So it was baiting us all along. The hunters have become the hunted. <sighs> Call it what you will. This will end with that snake dead. Here it comes. So they got jumped out in an ice field by a snake the size of a train. Just how stupid are these characters? The serpent isn't much when it comes to variety. Hey, let me go. You know, I'm tired of this shit. Perfect. 
As far as finishes and games go, that's pretty high up there. Is wrong. I'm just doing what the humans expect. The humans had us executed, forgetting how devoted we were to them. I swore I would have revenge, even if I had to sell my soul to the devil. Of course, I never suspected the man who resurrected us would be the one to do it. What man? I don't mind following his plans, if I can have my revenge on those revolting humans. And now I can use dark magic, thanks to him. Open your eyes, Trude. He's just using you! Stop fooling yourself! You were killed the same as me, you must realize that. Humans always look for a reason for their misfortunes and a place to vent their discontent. They readily believe what they want to believe. Even so, I will uphold the witch's code. Have you forgotten it? It looks like talking isn't going to get us anywhere, is it? Wait for us in hell. We'll join you when this is all over. <laughs> You're sure about this? Our path has already been stained with the blood of a comrade. And there's no going back now! So it's proper boss time. I've got a feeling that I'll be able to S rank this one. Can you handle this? First things first, a collectible right ahead. Hmm, he's got Gretchen. And I'm frozen now. It's going to be a recurring pattern. Oh, I'm dying too. Now, oh, for fuck's sake. So, um, about the boss. Stregel was a cool two for one deal. The human form was, um, an embodiment of medieval torture, I guess. Sort of like the enemies in the suffering, which represented different execution methods. And then we got a bizarre and somewhat funny beast form. Trude is a generic snake lady, wearing a bra. Because if there's one thing this game is concerned with, it's everyone's decency. Oh, I see. The hammer spell does wonders against the side snake. Hitting it doesn't deal any damage to the boss, though. That one's down, too. I think I get the idea. Knock both out and bait Trude into coming closer. I'll put you out of your misery. Does it work? Yes. She seems to be vulnerable to bear traps. Now again... We can use magic while Heinrich is down. Where is Gretchen? Just getting some health back, there is no other way to heal. Funny truly went out on her own. That was really stupid of her. I 
then she gets away. I'll put you out of your misery. Now watch closely as I try to hammer the two snakes. That first one worked perfectly. I'll go free Gretchen and hammer the second snake. Did you see that? The hammer was off-center and hit a protruding piece of background geometry. That's just a fun way this boss fight can randomly fuck you over. And it's happened again! Let's try to finish her off while she's down here. dead. And Gretchen's captured. Her brow was split in half, but stayed on. A new spell. Just like that, no reason. And our scythe got sharper. We might even kill enemies quicker now, unless the game ups their health. I told you it would be an S rank. This was released after Devil May Cry's and Bayonetta and Ninja Gaidens, I suppose. And the scoring system feels like it was slept on and never really tested. Collectibles time. There's a Titty Hydralisk boss, and she unifies the forest by turning everything to ice. I feel like that character trait was not developed by the game at all. A shame, it could have actually given her a character, a perverted strife for unity. It's a snake. Just a snake. As someone has noted, the trees do have tits on them as well, bulging out around the midsection. Apparently they're coordinated. It's a shame I always kill one of them immediately. Nothing here, or... I can't see shit at this scale, why bother with this? And someone drew a snake coming out of a snowy hole. Good for you, concept artist. You probably had to reference a couple of snake photos on Google. Job well done. Alright, just a peek at what awaits us in episode 6. A town ablaze. Okay, we've been to the ice world, the fire world comes next.